guys, good morning. Um, I'm here today, I'm going to make a simple uh, crepe uh, for breakfast, an apple crepe, but I'm actually changing a few things in the recipe to make it a little bit healthier. So I'm starting with these egg thins that um, I actually got from Costco. They are made with cauliflower, they don't have actual flour in them, so they're gluten-free, keto-friendly, paleo-friendly, um, and they have uh, certified cage-free eggs, so super healthy. I'm gonna use this as my base for my crepe instead of making the, um, the normal ones, which is a little bit healthier. And then I'm just um, starting with a couple of um, Fiji, app Fuji apples that I'm gonna slice and cut, um, chop into little cubes. I'm going to um, put about a tablespoon of this honey, um, a teaspoon of this um, stevia. I use, it's called Napia. I actually get it online on Amazon. It's from Australia. And then we're going to use some cornstarch at the end with a little bit of water, cinnamon, and then salt. So join me um, in a minute to see how we put this all together. Simply saute the five ingredients down until the apples are soft. So it's going to saute down and look kind of like this, um, where all the water has evaporated. I started with about a fourth a cup of water, but I think um, throughout the phase, I've had to add more in. So I just keep my little um, cup here to the side and continue to just pour in a little bit as um, it dries. And we want to cook the apples down until they're quite soft and almost uh, mushy. So um, we're gonna come back to this uh, once um, I get to the next step. Okay, so I just added in um, my cornstarch and water um, and that is going to make it into that saucy consistency that you're gonna want um, to be able to fill and top your crepe, so. All right, so. As I said, we um, have made our filling. I heated our crates, and then I'm really just going to stuff each of these with the filling that we made and save a little bit for the topping. And what I'm going to do is I'm gonna actually fill this with a little bit of honeyed yogurt. Um, I'll take plain yogurt and then <coughs> put a bit of honey and cinnamon in, on, inside, mix it, and then we will top this um, with that. All right, thanks, enjoy. Okay, so to make my, um, my yogurt that goes inside, I just take a few spoonfuls of this, I use Siggy's um, yogurt, and it's just plain, no sugar yogurt. I'm gonna take a little bit, just a squeeze of lemon. I'm gonna take a sprinkle of cinnamon, and then I'm going to take the honey that I used earlier, and I'm gonna put just a tad in there to sweeten it. So we'll do that. And then you mix it and add it into your crepe to bind it and close it and give it a little bit of cream, that creamy flavor that you would normally have with whipped cream. So see, we mix and voila. So as you can see, I stuffed the crepes with the apple filling. Um, I took a little bit of that yogurt cream that I made, put inside and then closed and then topped with the, the rest of the apples and the cream and a little bit of cinnamon and blueberries and voila, um, a much healthier version of apples and crepes. So I'm trying what I made and let's see, it's the first bite. Mm. Oh my God, it's amazing. The yogurt, you wouldn't even be able to tell that it's different than whipped cream. It's, it just adds that um, depth to the crepe that it was needed. So this is amazing, I can't wait for you to try it at home. <laughs> 